Alrighty, NT8 on the porch. Want to talk to uh, two of my best buddies over in Britain as to what's going on with this Iranian bullshit. I want you to take note of two things. France isn't doing anything. Germany isn't doing anything. So let's see. Shall we go back to 1939 when Hitler took over and he never did anything but to try and completely took over France? And who saved France? The British, the Americans, the Canadians. Oh, Canadians aren't doing shit for this thing either with Iran. So Britain gets two tankers captured by the Iran. Iranians. What's France and Germany doing to help it out? Oh, no. It's part of the British exit from the EU. Because the EU isn't doing a goddamn thing to support the British. But who is supporting the British? Uh, that would be the United States again. The United States helping save Britain in World War II. Uh, what did Canada do? Yeah, uh, they send a couple pilots over to help fly British planes and shit like that. But now, nobody's helping the British. The ships are being seized by Iran. Hmm. Let's see. What's that new carrier we got? HMS Queen Elizabeth? I don't know. I, I honestly, I can't keep track of that. But the Brits have a frigate, the Montus or Montrus, and now they're sending the HMS Duncan destroyer over there. What does France have? Nothing. What is German sent over? Nothing. But this country named India is sending two ships to deal with this Iran Strait of Hormuz fucking bullshit. Hmm. Anybody figuring it out beside me? Japan doesn't have any ships over there. But, you know, Iran's not confiscating or seizing uh, Japanese ships. Tankers. Why is that? Um, maybe that has to, uh... Japan's buying most of their oil from the United States. Germany is buying LPG by, by pipe from Russia and they're buying their oil from not from the United States where are they buying it from? Well, I'm betting they're buying it from Iran so
I don't understand why anybody is supporting the EU after the British decided to execute the EU. The EU is a shithole. Who's staying in the EU? I don't know. Uh, Poland? Uh, Germany, Belgium, uh, Sweden, uh, what the fuck? So I'm just here to tell you, 100% support for the British. Um, hopefully, maybe we can sell them one of our old aircraft carriers, our Nimitz class carriers. Give it to Britain. Let them run with that instead of keep rebuilding these or building this new. Queen Elizabeth, or whatever the fuck's name it is. I don't understand why anybody wants to support anything out of the EU, because the EU isn't supporting anybody. It's not supporting the United States. It's not supporting the British. And where's the money coming from? Oh, it's not France, it's not Germany. It's actually pathetic. So anyway, I just wanted to support my two old British guys, because I'm an old guy too. And my memory goes all the way back to World War II and before. But, you know, back in the Revolution War for the United States, France supported us to uh, knock off the British. Uh. And the British had gotten German Hessians to help them. But other than that, the United States was getting them too. Don't trust Germany. Don't trust France. Get the fuck out of the EU. Get out of it. This shit is going pathetic. All right, end of the story. And to you on the porch, we'll talk to you later.